ever put millions of hours into being cozy, forgetting about your responsibilities like the rest of us? Well, prepare for the new cozy obsession. Call off school. Tell your boss you're not coming into work today, cause it's time for some fields of mystery. I am not naked, okay? I'm just wearing my tuxedo made out of skin. <laughs> welcome, welcome in everybody. How are we doing today? I already have zero energy. All you need to know is that I saved my game in the middle of the day the last time I played this game. And if you were wondering, I do know the first thing about planting crops and being a farmer. It is giving them compliments. I bet you wish you could eat string cheese. I don't know if that's a compliment, but I did whisper it to him. <gasps> Eating string cheese is how I compliment myself uh, throughout my day. Eating string cheese is how I tell myself I'm doing a great job. <laughs> so, uh, we need to go get ourselves some free soup at the homeless shelter up here. I don't really know my character's backstory in this game. But if I couldn't afford clothing, I definitely couldn't have afforded a house. And for some reason, I... I, I traveled to this village. Uh, Mysteria? Mysteria. Mysteria. <laughs> I can say that word. And they gave me a free house, dude. Literal charity. For some reason. Ah, uh, free soup. My tummy is full of free soup. And my enemies. I'm a cannibal, I think. I don't eat my enemies. I'm not that brave, okay? Where am I going? Um, okay, it's 8 p.m., which means I can still get something done. Do you ever sometimes just sleep in until 8.20 p.m.? <laughs> I've done it. You know what's great about Taco Bell? Is even when you sleep in till 8.30 p.m., they're still open for you, you know? Taco Bell cares about me way more than the government, you know? I want them to be president, not you. Are you Taco Bell? No, get out of my way. Actually, I'm in your way. My bad. If I was made out of Taco Bell, I would rub hot sauce all over my body. You cannot fool me, chicken. I know that you're a middle-aged man in a chicken costume. I've had some great conversations with that chicken. Look at this. I have a friendship meter with that chicken. <laughs> I find that fantastic. That's game of the year qualities. I'm onto you, middle-aged chicken man. Henrietta, yeah, right. We all know that you got freaking plastic surgery to look like a chicken. Henry. Henry was that middle-aged chicken's name before he became a chicken man. A man chicken. A chicken made out of a man. Right now I'm just foraging. But these turnips are freaking super glued to the ground. I can't take those. Um, but right now I'm just foraging because this day is already, you know, sometimes a day is just a waste. How do I throw a fishing rod into the water? <laughs> you know what? I don't need to know how fishing rods work, okay? I've never been to Cabela's. That worked that time. I, okay. <laughs> I know how to Cabela. Cabela's. Cabellos. Cabellies. Fish, get over here and eat whatever delicious thing I put on the end of this. Come here, fishy. The bait I put on the end of this is tastes exactly like Baja Blast. You would love it. It's getting late. You should head home. I need to catch this fish guy. Come on, homie. Grab on. Gra there we go. We got his attention. The Baja Blast. I knew it would work. <laughs> so in this game, I got to press the Y button. There we go. Oh, he was a treasure chest? All right, note to self, treasure chests are shaped like fish when they're underwater. That's interesting. I've learned something new today. Look what I got. <laughs> oh my God, I think I got to go to bed. I don't know if I'm going to make it to my house. <laughs> but the, the ancient treasure was worth it. I am a night owl and this game is forcing me to fix my sleep schedule. No way. I'm sleeping with my treasure chest. <laughs> A man can sleep with his golden treasure chest. Good morning, everybody. <laughs> I just whip my... I just wake up right in the morning and whip out my golden treasure chest. I know I need to put these turnips in my pocket, but I kind of want to not get struck by lightning. Holy smokes, don't hold that above your head like that. I do want to go to the village, though, and show everybody my treasure chest. Is flexing on people how you get friends? Hello. <laughs> I'm flexing on you. Okay, I promised you I would get stuff done today. So we're going to do a bunch of quests because I think that sounds fantastic. Um, and there is one of these quests is how I get to have the farm animals, which is the part of the game that I want the most because spoiler alert, you can pick the little, you, you have little baby chicks and you can pick them up. <sighs> Take that Stardew Valley. Are you kidding me? There's still somebody I haven't talked to yet. They're literally hiding from me. What the heck? I have to introduce myself to 22 people. Too many people to introduce myself to. I barely wanted to introduce myself to one person. The perks of being naked in a thunderstorm. This is how I take my showers for free. I don't even have to pay a water bill. I found him right there. There's a forbidden creature I need to talk to. They're right up here. Who is it? Who are you? You're a drinking fountain. Do I not have eyeballs? Look at this here. And then we go right here. There is nobody here. Are you? You the person? Hello? 
Oh my! Now who do we have here? Oh, okay. I just forgot to meet the old lady. It is really nice though. My umbrella also works as a lightning rod. Two in one. Multiple versatile uses. I can already imagine whoever's watching me right now is literally just like, open up that treasure chest, Keegan. No way, I'm building the suspense. Request for salami. Okay. Salmon, sal- Oh, I- <laughs> Salmon. I accept your salami request. <laughs> I bring her salami and she's literally like, I didn't ask for salami. I asked for salmon. All right, so a good quest to go do. We got to go up to this mansion here, okay? And just discuss things within a mansion so you know. I don't know, discuss mansion things. These are rich people stuff. I don't know what rich people talk about. <laughs> there they are. Your request is reasonable, but could I suggest we add a sleep aid to the list of medicine? It keeps well. Speaking of sleeping, I was doing that thing last night where you fall asleep and then you go like this. <laughs> and then you fall back asleep and... <laughs> And then you do that again. I was doing that all night. It's awful. Could you two stop having a conversation? And could you address the naked man in the room? You know what I mean? You've heard of the elephant in the room? Well, now there's a naked man standing in the middle of the room. And he needs your freaking... I just... I need... He needs someone to talk to him, okay? No one in... No one today has complimented that he's wearing a hat right now. Completely naked besides a hat. Do you like my polka dotted boxers? I should be reading this stuff, huh? I don't play video games to read the story, okay? I only play video games to make friends with the chicken. Okay? That's right. Okay, what do you want to talk to me about? Thanks for answering my letter. Yeah, it was the least I could do. Um, by the way, do you guys have a bathroom? I've never used a rich person's bathroom before. <laughs> I've never used rich people toilet paper. Um, so yeah. Uh, yeah, I came here just to use the bathroom, actually. You sent me a letter? Oh. Um... Yeah, I read that. I didn't use it as toilet paper. So, yeah. I've sent out personal requests to anyone who might be able to help us rebuild our emergency stockpile. You need stocks? What? Stockpile? A pile of stocks? A pile of socks? That's a Pokemon move. You can count on me! You won't believe how many berries I can donate. You wouldn't be able to believe how many berries I can fit in my boxers right now. My polka dot boxers. I had something a little more substantial in mind. Could you ship 10 crops to help resupply our food rations? I'll give you these seeds to get you started. Seriously though, do you guys have a bathroom? Cause like, I know you guys gave me a free house, but it doesn't have a bathroom. So, um, I just can't hold it a lot longer. That's why I'm bringing it up so much. So, okay. I don't know, <laughs> I don't know what quest gets me the farm animals. I just want the cute farm animals. So another spoiler alert, in this game, you can put like, cute little hats and accessories on your farm animals so you can give them a lot of personality and that's the part of the game i want that's all i'm doing this for and also there's all these lucky lucky bachelors and bachelorettes okay and i wanted i want to date the chicken not because i'm a weirdo but because i want to figure out you know what's really going on here i know this you know i want to learn this harrietta's secrets i want to share my midlife crisis with the chicken okay i know i can't date the chicken okay <laughs> some characters have hearts next to their name and some don't so those are the ones that you can like date harrietta the chicken isn't single okay she has got her own freaking rooster at home how do i plant there we go throw those on the ground perfect i absolutely love when the sky pees on my crops so i don't have to <laughs> I killed it! Wait, did I just kill one of my plants? Oh, I'm gonna be so grumpy if I just did that. Did I just kill one of my plant babies? Oh, that is gonna be so sad. Cause then CPS is gonna come for me. And you don't even have to change the acronym cause it'll be Crop Protective Services. Oh no! Actually, I think I can- There we go, I gotta pick these turnips up. There we go. The lady wants me to send these crops to wherever they go. Here you go. I don't wanna date the chicken, okay? It was a joke. <laughs> but actually though, um, if of you guys, who do you think, who do you think is the person, the person that I want to woo in this game? I want to woo who with one of these. That, that's the Sims, right? I've never played the Sims before. Let's open this up. I need to know. I need to know. Give me some goodies. I got this from a fit. <laughs> that was a sugar daddy fish. That is crazy. I just got eight things of sugar. <laughs> I'm going to go save these later for a rainy day. Which would be today. So, the, yeah, that, yeah. I'm gonna save them for a, just some other time. Here, have this whole ass bush that I found. You're welcome. That's probably worth zero dollars. All right, what's the next quest, okay? I need to get this stuff figured out. Um, we gotta bring this guy 10 pieces of wood. Okay. 
man would like some of my wood. I get it. Lucky for him, I can murder so many trees right now. Because my farm is infested with trees. Yes, I am. I'm unforesting right now, okay? Unforesting is okay in video games, just not in real life. I would absolutely love it if you could inspect my wood for me. Uh, looks like you're ready for your crafting lesson. Come on, I just need to get a few things together first. Ryus is gonna teach me how to Minecraft. <laughs> so this is where we'll be crafting today. Feel free to use it anytime. Yo! Do I gotta wash my hands first? No, I can just touch this? Cool. Oh, good. They're gonna teach me how to make a fence. Let's start my fencing lesson. What? <laughs> Ryus actually just, like, pulls out a rapier and, like... Start stabbing at me. Wait, wait, what are we doing? But yes, fences are gonna be great because then I can keep Everybody off of my farm because like there'll be a fence in the way You know what I mean? And then they can think I'm they can be like, oh, I wonder what he's doing in there You know, I'm gonna build these really big fences. and They're like, oh, what is he doing? Oh, is he, he he maybe he's making crystal meth, but no, I'm just farming. That's it I'm just I'm just farming, but they won't know they won't know I love how I just had a saw and I was like sawing this table in half and then all of a sudden Something that I was- something just appeared there. I made that by just sawing it? I don't know. I sawed the air and it just- like, watch. You just saw the air and things come out of nothingness. That's how it works. That's how you craft everybody. I can get something from nothing, just like the government does with me with taxes. The government has to stop crafting taxes all the time, okay? I don't want them. Alright, fantastic. I have five fences to be a hermit. Crap. Here we go. That's right, no one's getting in here. Okay, <laughs> uh, Mr. Dragon uh, Ball Z or whatever your name is. How do I just okay good? I thought I was just gonna break it. <laughs> I had these here the whole time. Oh Wait, I got more excuse me a little tree. Oh, all right. I don't know how to cut you down. Trust me. This is helping my anxiety. Okay <laughs> No one needs to be on my property. Okay, what if they trip and fall on a snail? Okay, you know what I mean? I'm not letting him sue me like that. Actually, you know what? By the way, I think this snail belongs in my pants right now. Get in there. Yes. Have you ever heard of the term snail mail? I don't even know what that term means. <laughs> I could Google it, okay? But I don't feel like a Google right now. Literally, what am I selling? Like, dude, whoever comes and picks this up is gonna reach in here and like grab onto like a snail and then just a bunch of like loose lawn clippings. They're like, what is this? Hello, I want to let you know that I said hello to all 22 people and got 22 restraining orders. <laughs> you finished meeting everyone in town? That's wonderful. I mean, there's just 22 people, but yeah, thanks, man. Ah, thank you for the potato. Every 22 people you talk to in real life, you get a free potato. That's the rules. I'd like to see a Stardew Valley character do this. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's put these potatoes in the ground where they belong, I believe. Honestly, I want to take this hat off. I want to be more naked. That's that's right. <laughs> Raina asked me to meet her after 6 p.m. at the Sleeping Dragon Inn for a Friday night gathering. <sighs> social gathering. Social situation. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, could I meet everybody on, like, FaceTime instead, you know? Maybe... <laughs> I have to f see them in person? Oh. All right, well, I think I'm going to a party right now. And I don't have anything to- I brought- okay, I'll bring us a, a little pebble. <laughs> Hello, everyone. I'm just a wet, naked man. Let's- let's go. Where's the- where's the dance floor? All right, what kind of party is this? I brought a blunt weapon. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> I won't smash any skulls, hopefully. Uh, are you Arena? It is Arena-ing outside. Oh, not you. Josephine, okay. All right, well, I was told to meet someone here at 6 p.m. I know I'm four hours late, but- um, okay. Hello, Juniper. <laughs> I know what you're thinking. Yeah, what kind of message am I sending right now? <laughs> I am rock hard. <laughs> I wasn't expending to spend my hottest years in this podunk town, but here I am. What's a podunk? What if I put this rock in the soup? <laughs> It'll, yes, give me the soup. <laughs> oh, dang it. Wait, hang on. Wait, there's a throw button. <gasps> oh, wait. Someone's gonna take a bite off of this. Oops! Uh-oh. There's, like, tragic news in the morning. <laughs> like, someone, like, <laughs> choked on a rock with the soup they ate. Man, that sucks. I have a great alibi. Uh, I don't have pockets. So how could I have put a rock in the soup? I saw Dwayne the Rock Johnson in my soup today. I don't know about you, but we are doing a great job in this game right now. Absolutely crushing it. It's almost my bedtime, so I'm gonna relax with a fishing minigame. Ooh, perfect. Look at that. <laughs> Don't tell me it's getting late. I know. Get off my screen. Thank you, sir. 
Oh, okay, ready? Come on. Just get a little nibble. Yeah, you like it. Oh, we got a fish this time. A roach. A cockroach? I'm getting my bugs and fish all mixed up. I'm not gonna lie, I can tell why they named this fish a roach. Look at how stoned this guy is. Like, holy smokes. <laughs> and I'm not talking about the stone I threw in the soup. Demonetized. You know what, YouTube, have you ever thought about this? Maybe I didn't want to be monetized anyways. Hmm? Let's put this fish in this bucket. There's just a half alive freaking fish just flopping around in that cardboard box right now. Man. So we made $207 today. Damn, it's better than real life. Cockadoodle do. My non-existent rooster just woke me up. <laughs> I'm the worst farmer. I don't have any farm animals. God. Welcome to my 100 days in Fields of Mysteria. As you can see, I am doing a bad job. <laughs> I barely made it through day 12, man. I'm gonna go look at this request board. Wait, are you guys putting up a wanted poster? <laughs> the naked pebbler is what they call me. Yeah. Remember when I like killed that person by putting a, 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 a stone in the soup? I like to keep plenty of trail mix on me. Um, could you make some more of it? Okay, I'll make you some checks mix, sure. <gasps> All right, good news. There was no wanted poster up there. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I'll be at the inn this evening. Uh, Lord Island's been so excited to play his new game with us. Why wasn't I invited to play? What are you guys gonna play, Monopoly? I'll- I won't flip the table over this time, okay? I'll have fun. I oh yeah, they just leave rewards like this in the box for me. Why didn't you just come to my farm? Oh wait, never mind. <laughs> they can't get to my farm. I blocked them out. I get it. I know why they do this now. Well, I w I'm just keeping my space. There's a cute bird on that tree. I want to give him a high five so bad. You know what? I better start acting like a farmer. I'm going to go buy some crops, okay? I don't give a crop, you know? Or I do give a crop. Give me all this. I don't know. I'll take a little bit of everything. What's this one? Daffodils? I'll take them. Give me two. Give me three daffodils. I'm trying to act like a farmer, okay? I don't want him to know that I'm actually a let's player. <laughs> I love this cart out in the middle of nowhere. And <laughs> there's a caterpillar for 20 bucks. Dude, I'm going to start selling caterpillars. Why not? <laughs> Why would I buy a caterpillar for $20? We got to convince that caterpillar that he could just crawl off of that cart at any time he wants and go live his life, you know? Good thing mosquitoes don't exist in Mysteria, you know? It makes being naked a lot easier. Excuse me while I hoe around for a bit. Have some sprinkles. Oh man, I do want a donut. <laughs> Why do you guys got to be freaking vegetables? God, fiber is overrated. I want donuts. I need to become friends with this chicken. Um, do you think that chickens like raspberries? Let's figure it out. Excuse me, sir. Can I go play with your chicken? <laughs> I am not doing anything weird to this chicken, okay? It's called friendship. Henry, Clu Henry, Henrietta clucks at you. Uh, amiably? There you go, chicken. I don't know what amiably means, but I fed him a raspberry. I don't know. Do you like that? How do you know? Like, yeah, they have like, hang on. Let me check if this chicken is our buddy now. Well... The chicken didn't like that or love that. Well, I'll tell you right now, that chicken is gonna be freaking loving me when I'm holding a freaking deep fryer over my head next time. Well, if no one wants to be my friend, then I'll just go catch a friend, okay? I will catch a friend right now. Here you go. Yeah, just like that. Reeling them in. Oh, God. That's uh, great. I will draw a smiley face on it with a Sharpie, okay? It is my friend, okay? I'm like that one kid from Ed, Ed, and Eddie whose only friend is a freaking piece of stick. Plank, remember that guy? <laughs> Actually, I do want to bring this up. Everybody here has been suspiciously nice to me. You know what I mean? And I'm starting to, I don't know, I'm getting some like, I don't know, there might be some cult vibes going on. Something might be, you know, like why is everybody so nice to me? I'm just a weird naked man running around. Because I'm running around pretending I'm not naked, but I know that they can see it. Like, they're looking right at my nipples. Hey, knock, knock. I know there's been earthquakes and everything, but I want to go into the mines, you know? Let me in there. There won't be another earthquake, I promise. I'm telling you right now, I swear there's no Doug Trios around, okay? Doug Trios don't even... Doug Trios don't work here, okay? That's a different franchise. So how could we have earthquakes? We're going to be fine. I love how I've absolutely done nothing. Well, besides make friends with a... A, a driftwood that I pulled out of the ocean. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I've gotten nothing done. Well, the thing is, okay, I wanted- we're doing the quests, but I have to wait until I can get tw 10 cr crops or whatever. Hey man, can you make me like a plane? I need like a crop duster. No, I'm not gonna fart on my plants. What is wrong with you? Yes, I did fart as I walked past that group of people, okay? Sue me, I don't know. Oh, I don't wanna- I was gonna get- 
You want a pink grasshopper? Actually, you know what? Let's give this super masculine man a pink grasshopper. I think he'd really like that. You know, Chainsaw, I admire that you've taken over the old farm. No, stop talking. I'm trying to give you a grasshopper. Why do you have to tell me your whole life story? Or why are you telling me my life story? What? I am pressing this A button so much right now. Take my freaking grasshopper. Fine. I was trying to give this pink grasshopper a good life, you know? Like, it could be your little pet. A and you know what? Now I'm going to go sell it. Okay? Selling it to the... F yeah. Someone else is going to have this grasshopper. They're probably going to turn it into freaking grasshopper soup. All right. We got to start cleaning this place up, okay? We got to get Tom Nook in a good mood so we can have a perfect town. You know? We can't have weeds everywhere. What the heck? Actually, though, this game does have, like, a system. Like, we are trying to, like, bring up our town rank. And then I think when we bring up the town rank, KK Slider is going to come by and he's going to throw a freaking awesome concert for everybody. All right, one more tree here. And then I believe it's Friday. Okay. You know, TGI Fridays at the inn. I got to go to the inn. There's that party I have to go to. You see, usually when I go to parties and stuff, I just clutch onto the nearest wall. Parties are hard, man. Even if you're wearing a party hat, you know, you know, the party hat does make things like at least 10% better. Look at this weird fish hole, dude. Okay. Never mind. Okay, this I, uh, one time I went like this and I grabbed on to there we go. Glug glug. <gasps> oh Hey, I'm gonna take that into the museum. Animal Crossing called. They want they want their diving mechanic back. By the way, this guy's trying to fight me right now. Look at that. Absolutely throwing hands. That's insane. Oh, we gotta go here. We'll 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 go to the museum some other time. Yo, the party. Where's the wall? I gotta find a wall to clutch onto. <gasps> okay. <gasps> Okay, I'm safe over here in the corner. I'm in timeout for some reason. I don't know. I, I was naughty. Being so naughty right now. Oh my god. All right, everybody. Okay. I will mingle, okay? Is this one of those parties where you... Ooh. Oh, I got the rock back. <laughs> well, I guess I didn't kill anyone. That's great. Anyway, is this one of those kind of parties where you have to, like, show up and bring something in Tupperware? Hello? Right, no. Oh, you can... Oh! Here we go. I was wondering how I cook. I guess I gotta go. Am I allowed to use your countertop? Okay. I do have a lot of sugar. Yo, I can make 50% of a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Look at that. I've got sugar and berries. Hey, yo, it's me. I'm sorry I didn't bring anything in the Tupperware, but next time I swear I'll bring my famous meatball recipe in Tupperware. How do I talk to you? Holy smokes. Turn in. <laughs> you made it. What did I tell you? It's a full house. Why don't you go around and see what everyone's up to? Oh, and here's your free drink. Oh. <gasps> Did she just give me an alcoholic drink? <laughs> I love how she put a straw in it. That's awesome. This song is good and all, but it's kind of giving us some Lord of the Rings vibe. We need to we need to turn this party up, you know? You know, let's let's get some freaking Lil Jon playing. Welcome to our inaugural session of dragons and drama. Wait, maybe these are my kind of people. Are you all nerds? Is this just a nerd party? Well, good thing I brought my Magic the Gathering deck. <laughs> We're playing Commander? Yeah, let's go! If I roll a natural 20, can I take my underwear off? I wrote a backstory for my character. Chainsaw, she's a druid. <laughs> and she can talk to flowers. <laughs> and just like that, I fell in love instantly. Oh my god. Follow my lead, Celine. I set all these useless stats to one, so my mind stat can be 67. <laughs> Oh, that's so relatable. Whenever I level up in real life, I try not to put, you know, I try not to put my points into my fart stats, but it's somehow it's, it keeps going up. I don't know why. If you look at the rules, section 107, paragraph two, you'll see this. That actually brings me back to Dungeons and Dragons. I have played it like a little bit. It's just like, it's impossible to get friends. It, it's impossible to get five people in one room at one time. It's impossible. I'm telling you right now, you can't do it. <laughs> I dare you to do that. But um, I always remember we would, pull out the the booklet the, we had little hardcover booklets and we would look up the rules and so how do i do magic missile oh my god look here chainsaw i'm whittling out some miniatures for the game that's actually so adorable okay i love this town i'm sorry that i've been making so much fun of you guys behind your back but you guys are actually like pretty awesome well that was fun oh god Whew. finally out of there i gotta go wash my hands with like tanning lotion or something freaking nerds <laughs> gross pale <laughs> Nerds, glass 2020 40 vision, <laughs> weirdos. I had to freaking hold my breath in front of all those nerds, <sighs> acting like I like what? I like cool things. Oh, I love Baldur's Gate. <laughs> oh, so much. Oh God, my treasure chest is getting a little full here. How do I make more of these? Hopefully we can. Hello, tree. I just want to let you know that you're about to fall over. 
See, I told you. I warned you. I don't know. You know, stumps do make great, you know, chairs. You know, if we were going to have a bonfire here, this stump would be perfect. But you know what? This feels like a great place for me to stub my toe. Oh, I got to stop swinging things around. I have no more energy at all. I mean, it's bedtime anyway, right? Crystal Ball, who is the fairest of them all? The correct answer is Jensen Eccles. Oh, God. I thought you were going to say me. Uh, but you're right. You're right. That is actually true fact. <laughs> Don't jump on the bed, sir. Jensen Eccles from Supernatural. It's <laughs> what a hottie. Well, there you go. A couple bucks away from 69. That would have been great. Oh, and here's my terrible farm. Look, it looks like crap. Stop showing that to YouTube, please. No more of this. Oh, oh, a little. What do we get? There's a weird smiley face. Oh, ooh. <gasps> oh, the whole town leveled up. I think it's a bottle filled with poison with a smiley face on it. So. It should have a frowny face, but that's how they get you. That's how they get you. Ah, oh, you know what? I want to drink this. It looks inviting. No, wait, you can't. Don't drink that. It's not It's not green juice that's good. It's green juice that is kill you. Well, I had a lovely time playing this game. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, no, I will not put a shirt on. I hope you have a great night and a great day. And I love this game. I'll probably play it some more. Thank you for watching. I hope I can get some cute farm animals in the next episode. <laughs> That'll be great. Bye.